What is up my Irish Bagels and welcome to some Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay. So today guys I want to talk to you all about is basically COD 2020, Call of Duty, Black Ops Cold War or whatever it is going to be called. Now we still don't know what the game's title will be for launch but on Reddit a Call of Duty pro player named Chance or Mox who is on the Florida Mutineers team said this on Reddit. In this post he says, stay hopeful guys, the devs over at Treyarch are really interested in making next year a great year for competitive, love heart emoji, and I'm 100% serious, where someone replies to him saying, please tell me this isn't just the usual yearly comments, because I've been hearing this from pros for a few years it feels like now, where Mox or Chance replied saying, nope. Just meetings with the devs to discuss competitive philosophy. There's more to it, of course. And to be honest, I don't even know if I'm allowed to share what I just shared. I know how hopeless some of you are, but all I want is for us as a community to get excited and to get behind and support the devs over at Treyarch. Love heart emoji. Spread positive energy, guys. So this basically is just telling us that pro players have met with Treyarch devs to discuss maybe even change some things in COD 2020 which is good because we'll probably end up having a playlist for comp COD competitive just like League play back in Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 4 which was very very good. Now a lot of pros have felt that people aren't listening to them at Infinity Ward which is really 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 true so for people who don't care about esports side this all but confirms that Treyarch are creating the next Call of Duty game and I feel like with the input that pros can give will actually make the game more better for people and it just shows that they're actually listening to people and we could easily see YouTubers then coming in as well and doing kind of the pub site so we could easily see that it'd be it'd be good if maybe what they did was have some maps say like eight maps that are fully competitive and they be played on league play and then you have ones that are for just public matches and they are just played on the public match side which would be even better because personally i think that's the way it should be and then kind of weapon tuning and everything should be all over the board, I think. You never really know what they're going to really do, but yeah. You know, just a very quick video. I hope you guys did like it. If you did, please hit the like button. Right beside the like button is the subscribe button. And beside the subscribe button is the notification bell where you can hit and stay up to date whenever I upload to the channel or whenever I go live on the channel, which is rare, which is very rare. Speaking of live streams, I have a live stream, I have a Twitch down in the description below where I live stream weekly on numerous games like Modern Warfare, Warzone, Minecraft, Battlefront 2, Rainbow Six Siege, Minecraft, I already said that one, but many, many more as well that I have on my PlayStation as well, like Uncharted and everything like that. I also have a Twitter, which I manually update whenever I upload a upload a video or whenever i go live link down in the description below as well and yeah that's it guys hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace